Uh, Berlino, Numero, Trace, Bailey, you gotta click that ready button there. If you're uh, here and ready. Oh, look at that! Yeah! Fight! Locating presidents. Round one. Let's do it, Mike. Oh, what am I doing here? So you choose which guy you want. And then what he's armed with, and then you'll get a random one. <laughs> what the crap? Okay. And then he's armed with the, the right side is what he's armed with? Yep. And then you get a third one. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> this is so crazy. Newcomer Let's do it. Versus serial voter. Serial voter. Okay, what do we do here? Alright, we're on an oil platform and we're armed with lightsabers. So, I'm a pirate, first of all. That in itself, like, our mateys. I shoot tear gas and I can't stop dancing. So, with my pirate dance lightsaber tear gas combo move on this oil platform, you're not going to be conjoined for much longer. You're going to be dead. Hmm. Interesting. Uh. Well, <laughs> if you're conjoined twins. So how does this work out? Since you only have one leg, do you have two sets of arms, though? That's the thing. Do you have two sets of workable arms? Apparently, I have only one leg and no legs at the same time. Hmm. So, so you're if like, uh... you can accomplish that, I'm pretty sure you could accomplish fighting with an art lightsaber on an oil platform. Maybe. Who knows? I'm sure you could try to fight. I mean, I'm the sure pirate that's gotta be like it's something to do with the force. Like, obviously, hmm? the force is with me strongly because I'm that. But I mean, the pirate can't stop dancing now. Right. As so he's down to slip. But I, I, I use it to my advantage. These, this is good dancing. All right, this isn't no good dancing. Is it like yeah. good, good break dancing? It's. <laughs> it, I just go through all the the types of dance. Yeah. I just go through them all. And just do them perfectly. <laughs> so you can as you I can rock say your socks. Your pirates, the Lord of Dance fight. Yep. Maybe. Yep. Okay. Pirate Lord of Dance, who shoots no. tear gas and fights with a lightsaber on an oil platform, no. and destroys conjoined twins. You can't destroy my conjoined twins that have no legs and only one leg at the same time. Like I couldn't even destroy my own conjoined twins. So, don't tell you, man. Pirate is just gonna slice and dice you. While you're crying, no mercy, because I'm a pirate. Pirate's life, all about that booty. Mm, no. <laughs> this is so weird. Sorry, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to go with the uh, the pirate. That no legs, one leg combo is pretty tough to overcome. Yeah, so, uh, I think that's going to be the winner here. Chablam, 100%. <laughs> Joint Twins Whatever. sliced and diced, man. I should have yeah, tried something did, else besides You get a whole lot of love from the computer there. Cereal he got a leg back. Wins. Yeah. Boom, I voted for the winner. Look at that XP. Next round. <laughs> Oh, there we got it. We got it. Oh, dope. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got this time. <laughs> Bailey is uh, pretty vicious here, so I I'm excited to see. <laughs> How he fares against the newcomer. Yeah, let's just go with it. <laughs> Word whacker versus newcomer. All right. Giant. Oh, 100 degrees Three, of freezing. Two. <laughs> Super fight. What? All right. All right. So. I'm a Heisenberg wearing a robotic exoskeleton 
and screams names of my attacks before using them. I'm pretty sure my only attack is I am oh the one gosh. who knocks, and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> this is a tough one because I like both of these people. Okay, so I'm Jack Bauer, and I have throwing spears, and I'm wearing skis. And you'll notice that we're in a giant cave, and it's 100 degrees below freezing, so it's pretty cold out there. So the exoskeleton might get really brittle in the in the cold, and my throwing spears might be able to pierce it. Uh, I, I mean, I doubt it. I'm pretty, pretty well. sure, as Heisenberg is super resourceful, if you've ever watched the show, and he's a chemist, he would probably put a lot of like de-icing coolant to go through his exoskeleton. So. Okay, all right. But I mean, we're talking about Jack Bauer here. I mean, this guy can do anything. If you've seen the series, he's he pretty bad. Eh? He he finds a way to win. That is true. Mm. Jack Bauer's pretty ba. I mean, at the end of the day, Heisenberg is cancer, and he he dies at the end. I mean, spoiler alert. But oh wow. Not really. It's I'm really glad I've already finished it. <laughs> yeah, thanks, jerk. Yeah, whatever. If you haven't seen it now, it's too late. But you're yeah, where, yeah. I guess, I mean, it just says 100 below freezing. That doesn't mean there's ice anywhere, so your skis are kind of useless. But not, you get pretty there's, slippery there's, no proof that, there's, there's no proof that there isn't ice anywhere either. Yeah, but it have you ever tried game, There's a lot of dripping water and everything, so Ooh. man, I could be go I could be moving pretty fast. I'm either way, sure I don't know about really robotic exoskeletons are that fast either, though. But I'm the only one with a weapon here. I'm the only weapon, and I got range here. Exoskeleton is a weapon. <laughs> mm. well, all right, my vote is in, but I'm not telling you who I vote for. Yeah. <laughs> it all full of Jace. <laughs> Just ruin the surprise. Yeah, I had to do it. I had to. It's just that's how it is. If I lost to Jack Bauer again, I'm going to be so pissed. <laughs> oh, 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 nice. nice. The boot lord has chosen. Oh. Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man. Woo! And the only reason is because he had a ranged weapon. Boom. Because he would have just like threw and speared through your face before you got there with your own bike, exo skeleton crap. Yes, and I've He's never thrown spears. a spear in the entire Twenty Four series. That's <laughs> very true. That that is true. Hey, so but it's a lot of them. You guys so. are judging on his accuracy with projectile weapons with gunpowder. I voted yeah. for Heisenberg. But don't even. I know you did. But I'm talking about that guy over there. <laughs> oh dang it! Serial letdown friend. What the heck is? Because his name is Serial Voter. That's his title. Doing it. <laughs> figure out what this is. <laughs> I'm just going to go with it. I don't know what it is. Good. I'm ready. Serial Voter versus Newcomer. Let's do this. All right. We're in the White House. No supernatural power. Two. Allowed at all. So we got Snake, which I'm doing solid Snake. This isn't like a Snake. This is Snake. Oh, whatever. You can't snake. Do that. No, his name. That's what he uses. Is Snake. Yeah, but his name's Solid Snake. So you no, that's in I... that's in the newer ones. You're Just Snake you though. Snake, though. No, it's Snake. It's You're a person. Also a hoarder. Yeah. What's a velocipede? <laughs> that's why I don't know. I was like a hoping it was raptor like, with a yeah. hundred legs or something. Yeah, Anyways, all right, you know what? Fine, I'll go with normal snake. I'm legit animal snake. I'm gonna shrink ray you, and I'm gonna eat you. <laughs> yeah, with simple. What arms? Uh, I'm a snake. I'm gonna eat you. Yeah, you're, but you don't you're have small. Arms to use this armed with the shrink ray, but it's just kind of like useless there. No man, sitting there. It, I if mean, I'm, no, he could just, I'm on a it doesn't. I'm armed with it, so that means it's a it's a shrink ray made for snakes. If it's if I'm armed with it, I, there's not just a shrink ray there. I'm armed and ready to go with the shrink ray. That's questionable at best. Uh, well, my velocipede is. I feel like a shrink cooler. ray is kind of supernatural. Shut up, Mike. That's not. <laughs> Supernatural yeah. is like totally. supernatural is like magic powers, like powers that you can use. Not this is more like science. 
Shrink Ray is more sciencey um, than I'm supernatural. I'm also on a velocipede, and with my can't hold it can hold breath forever. Even if you ate me, I'd be down in there, and my velocipede would, with its millions of clawy leg things, would rip you apart from the inside. Uh, but I'm a hoarder, so I've obviously, as a snake, hoarded a lot of things and eaten a lot of things that I shouldn't have. And so I'm it. I'm used to it, man. I'm like, I'm I've got the iron stomach of a snake here. Take on whatever comes at me because I've hoarded all these things. An iron stomach, it is still susceptible to velocipede claws. You don't even know what a velocipede is. <laughs> you can't say that. <laughs> Snake man. Uh, Does that mean someone voted for me? It, sometimes. Oh. I didn't... Vote for the Lucha Libre wrestler. Oh man, it's all about the snake. Chomp, chomp. Shrink ray, chomp. <laughs> Velocipede for the win. Shrink ray, chomp, man. Oh, 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 dang. Oh. Destroyed. Two for two. Newcomer is the super fight champion. Hey, golf clap. Golf clap. Uh, <laughs> all right, I'm gonna start a new game. Get us back in, and we can't talk for a Wait, second. Win? Yeah, all you right. you won. Woo! All right, I gotta go through, do all these card things. If you're not voting, you should be. That makes it obvious. Orator, do this creates. All right. All right, invites were sent. J Mill back. Dude, I hit level two and I got a bunch of sweet cards. Yep. You never had this. This is called the, the relationship. I just want to touch you. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. What's going on over there? <laughs> just messing around. Don't worry. Whoa. Sounds like I need to come over. All right. We ready? Hit those ready buttons. I'm ready. Let's do this. Fight! Locating presidents again. Round one. Round one. Oh, J. Boo, what's up? Back at it again. Oh, yeah. Uh. <laughs> 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 I've got to use this. No! No! Dang it. It's okay. Oh man. Newcomer this is gonna be dope. Y'all ready for this? Serial voter. Alright, let's see where we are. We're in the zoo and the, we're both drunk. Three, two, <laughs> one. Oh, gosh. So I'm on a velocipede, which is automatically an instant win, I guess. Uh no. Way. It obviously just destroys everything. You're drunk. You don't know where you're to how to even like get your velocity. The velocipede's not drunk. It knows I'm an angel. Yeah. Velocipede's but gonna do what the Velocipede you're wants. You're on it, trying to ride it and everything, and you're locked in an antique diver's helmet. You can't yeah. even see very well. Don't need to see. I'm an angel. You don't know where to go. So you don't know. I'm a dope super sumo wrestler with laser eyes. Dope sumo wrestler. And unlimited livestock. Okay. Well, so, you know, I could just catapult you from far away and everything like that, and if you get close... I'll destroy you with my laser eyes. All right, we're gonna. All right, we're gonna. We gotta define right now what is a velocipede. I'm gonna Google this. Velocipede, real quick. Vela. Velocipede. Velocipede. Why should be something ridiculous? Oh no way it is. <laughs> what is it? 
Oh no. Okay. Oh my gosh. It is. It is ridiculous. All right. For uh, those who, let's see, I'm going to add this on chat. Um, oh my gosh. Right it's a freaking early. It's a bike. <laughs> yep. It's yeah. an early crappy yep. bike. It is. <laughs> oh, oh okay. man. So, with that knowledge, uh, I don't even you need to lost like just days. like super. <laughs> yeah, I sure would have. <laughs> Oh man! Angel on a velocity. Uh, that looks perfect. Yeah. My laser eyes wreck you. Let's just put it that way. I mean, you couldn't even get close, even on your early crappy bicycle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I. <laughs> oh, I'm so sad. That's what that actually was. You know, it's pretty. It's cool that we're in a zoo, so I have unlimited zoo animals to also use. With Listen, uh, I'm just gonna ride on my velocipede with my oh, helmet yeah. on and sing songs. <laughs> I'm gonna sing hymns to the Almighty uh, God, who I am an angel for, and He'll smite you. That's what I'll do. I'll call in a favor. I'll be like, "Listen, I, I think you're listen, here, and listen." Time is out, buddy. No, I'll be like, "Listen, they're still voting." Like, "Listen, Master, smite the sumo wrestler." Bam. Yes. What? How does this even die? Yes. Angel. Angel pulls it in. What? Laser oh, dang. Ooh, dang laser it. eyes through your chest. Let's be honest. The angel wouldn't lose because the angel is immortal. Yeah. It's yeah, true. Yeah, but didn't bring that up. But, I mean, I was, I was trying to be fair, man. I was trying to, like, give it a... I mean, how do you beat that oh, normally? You, you gotta be cutthroat. Right. <laughs> oh, jeez. Gotta go for the win. All right. Let's see here. See what we got with these two. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, this isn't so bad. I mean, unless we eliminate more like immortality from our repertoire, I guess, in any situation. Yeah, I suppose. I mean, I guess death doesn't have to be the end of the fight either. Truth. What the heck? Alright, here we go. What do we got? Alright, you're on pins and needles, and no supernatural powers are allowed. Oh, both for <laughs> Oh my gosh. Uh oh. Okay, so throwing bears automatically just destroys anything. That's not 100% true. And I could be throwing hundreds of bears. And Spartans were tough, don't get me wrong, but come on, like a Spartan can only take maybe one bear, two at most. I could throw. Yeah, but there only the needs to be one Spartan to kill the hobo. <clears throat> you rely on sonar to see. No, I'm throwing bears, and I can throw them perfectly with my sonar. Yeah, because that's how sonar works. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> I mean, you have tiny T-Rex arms. How are you even going to do anything with that? Like, you have nothing to do with it. Like, the bears will just it's destroy Spartan. this Spartan It'll here. Just bite out your freaking neck. That's all. Only one needs it. Like, there a hobo, needs he, need, he, he needs help. And so, it's a good thing that he's got a lot of bears to help him because they're going to kick the Spartans. But... but you can only throw them if you pick me up on your sonar every so many seconds. Oh, it's perfect. Every second, so many seconds. It doesn't have to be every so many seconds. It can be Anytime. Now, throws bears, wins, boom. Sonar, you can't pump out a bunch of sonar, or else it just comes jarbled back. You have to wait for it to ping back. <laughs> what? This game. <laughs> this game. <laughs> Throwing bears wins. You can throw as many as you no, want. It doesn't doesn't matter. Because you have to one, do sonar if I'm not behind a building and you hit me with it, and then check your bear. Let's let's Google sonar now. So guys, like, guys, I really tried hard to find a Spartan with tiny arms, but I could it's not. A, it's a technique that uses sound propagation to navigate, I mean, communicate with, or having, detect objects. Having T Rex arms, it's rough. yeah, kind of. Dumb. But I mean, it is. Rough. I can detect oh. objects just like did, that. Did oh. did uh, what's his name? Is his name Leonidas? Is that the guy that kicked him yep. into the pit? Yeah. Did he use yeah. his arms? I, no. I still have legs. Yeah. Yeah. Kick a bear. Try that. It's a. I'm sure. He, I'm a... sure Spartans did kick bears. No, no, they didn't. Oh Choosing my gosh! I... Ah. Oh, it's gonna be freaking. Oh ah. yeah, oh. <laughs> dude. I'm sorry, man. Oh, what? Oh, okay. Yeah, I did. 
This oh. is confused for a you second. were such a horrible friend last time. I didn't think it was going to pull through. Dude, Spartan, Spartan would beat a hobo. Not with T-Rex arms. Ruins the oh, entirety no. of their... He's got their, legs. They can't even, like, carry their shields and their weapons now. Think what about... You, you would a hobo be able to throw a bear, though? Would a hobo <laughs> be able like, to throw a bear? That just, like, ruins their entire phalanx no thing. No, no way. A hobo wouldn't be able to throw a bear. <laughs> Think about but hobos. You can. We that... work in Salt Lake. It we says throws bears, day. right? But how far <laughs> is a hobo gonna be able to throw a bear? Like it it's gonna be able to be like uh, just like toss a bear. Throw a bear. Oh, man, it goes after him. Throw another bear. It goes after this him. It's rough. I'll have to get oh out man. Of Sorry, my guy. <laughs> I, I couldn't let you have that one. I got about Spartans, man. The best is with the arms. They just be like flinging their arms and like just kicking everything. Like. Ten of them. That's the thing. There were ten. Yeah, but the bears. The number of bears is arbitrary. <laughs> Biblical times during a kitten stampede. Kitten stampede. <laughs> One super fight. Jamil go. All right. So I'm a mad scientist, so I can think up of crazy things, and I am. Uh, even though you're a super genius, Musketeer is way back in the day, so like super genius. Yeah, but we're in day, biblical times. Even, um, that's pretty fair. Dang it. <laughs> yeah, but like as a mad scientist, you did alchemy and maybe some like weird snake poisons? Yeah, so I got but... some poisons on my side. Throw yeah, them at I'm you. A, I'm a super genius, and I'm just going to throw burritos at your weird mustache, and it's just going to get grody. But my mustache can stretch and move at will, so I can just block them away. Yeah, the grody mustache, I think, is worse for you. Always, so it's just gonna my, hit your eyes. Well, my mustache can also stretch really and into move fonts. and choke you out before you even get near me. But you're only really, like, you're super into fonts, though. So, like, I could throw a book at you with some crazy fonts. Because I'm a super books. genius. And you're boom. You're throwing burritos. That, that, that was a stretch. This font. this font is so groovy. Comic Sans. Because you're not that mad of a scientist. <laughs> oh, oh snap. Type of fonts. Mad scientists are usually pretty evil, so I think I'm bent on world domination slash killing everybody. I mean, so I think that overarches. I, don't, the really I mean, evil mad scientists thing. just mad, do my weird, crazy things. I don't, things. I don't know do necessarily if they're evil, but I'm also a super genius. So it doesn't matter if you think it up, I can think of a counteraction. I would say that our genius level is at least equal. Mad no, scientists. I wouldn't. Agree. I wouldn't. Mad scientist is, is genius level, but he's just gone a little crazy. Mm. So the the genius is there, but I also have my mustache, which I can use to my advantage over your burritos because I can block away burritos and I can choke you out with my awesome. Also, you're forgetting about the kitten, the kitten stampede. stampede. So are the kittens going to attack your mustache while you're trying to attack me? No, because it's way up in the air. They're too small to jump that high, so they it's can't even stampede. get up that high anyway. Yeah, but... <laughs> they're going to be everywhere. They're just little kittens. Tiny little kittens. I don't... Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Boom! Oh, dang. Both of you. Dude, Matt's <laughs> the mustache, man. The it's mustache. all about that stash. Power of the stash. Power stash. Is it because none of us can grow mustaches? Yep. Is that what it is? I was just jealous of the Matt scientist. I can Guys, tell. I'm two for two right now. I'm just one Shut up, I'm starting another game. Alright. I invited my friends. Cool. How do I change my name? Uh, you have to do it at the title screen. Actually, you might be able to do it at the bottom now. Yeah, bottom left, click. I wish it just show me the ones that I have right now. Yeah, it's in beta. It's pretty fair. I'm just saying. <clears throat> uh, there we go. Get some scissors, but no. All right, we re re ready. Oh, sorry, I was picking a name. 
boom. Tiny streak. Doing it. Parking the Pope Mobile. Round one. Oh boy. All right, up again. <laughs> <laughs> this is terrible. Hey Bailey, you know what that means? Next round you're mine. <laughs> this is great. This is great. Oh my gosh. Newcomer versus <laughs> Tiny Streaker. On pins and needles again, and you lack depth perception. Super fight. Okay, well, you're you. Know, if you lack depth perception and you're drunk, like you just fall over and you're done. That's rough. That doesn't, that doesn't really do much. I'm a blob with a T-Rex head on a stick. Like you're you're gonna be on the ground, and my T-Rex is gonna come over and just like smack you. <laughs> And I'm riding a battle that? cat for freak's sake. <laughs> Come on. I well, mean, the cats are needed that. They can win this challenge. Even if I fall over and I'm drunk and I have no depth perception, I'm the Grim Reaper. I have literal control over death. All I got to do is touch you or any of your other things, and they're insta-dead. And I'm also 10 stories tall, so I just got to flail a... around. 10 stories tall. I didn't see that. 10 stories tall. <laughs> I have a pretty awesome well, Blob, range though. Blob's have... sizes, too. Uh, yeah, but I mean, then at the end of the day, getting bigger doesn't help you at all because it's then I still small. just smack you and you're insta dead because I'm the Grim Reaper. Here's the real question if you can touch me because you're drunk, is the blob alive? I'm so glad you brought that up because that's the same thing I was thinking. Why wouldn't it be? I'm riding a battle cat, it has to be alive. Well, good, thanks. I really appreciate that because that means I can now kill you with my Grim Reaper abilities. And even if I'm not alive, <laughs> let's say I'm not, okay, for the sake of the argument. <laughs> then I totally have control over the Grim Reaper because you've, you've got no power over me. Yeah, but we've already established that you are alive now. You admitted it straight okay, up. So now I'm dead and I'm a blob. <laughs> well, well, that was too late now. Head on a stick. I mean. I still have my scythe and I just slice it around and cut you up. Even, even though I'm. I'm 10 so that I'm like 14 blobs now. <laughs> no, just <laughs> melt away. And then I win. Blobs win everything. Have you seen Pokemon? Uh, which I don't remember a blob in Pokemon. There's a lot of them. Are you talking about Ditto? There's Ditto. There's a bunch of different. I mean, there's, there's blobs. Are you talking about the originals? Or are you talking about all the new ones? All the ones that I remember. Oh. oh. The boat lord has chosen. Yep. No, my win streak. Yep. <sighs> I was gonna choose the blob, but he didn't bring up the fact that he could just Your like encase the Grim BS. Reaper. That's all right, true. all right, Bailey, let's do it. I think I was targeted because of my awesome win streak. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I was no, no. He's the blob. The blob's not alive. No, he said it was alive. He admitted it. I don't care I, back on after admitting I'll it. I'll admit that I said that because I thought that's what the players wanted. They wanted boo, boo. But I don't think a blob can <laughs> I don't know if this will win, but it's just going to be good to visualize. No, Joy. <laughs> Word uh. versus obvious orator. Yeah, that's me. That yeah. sounds good. All right, we're in a glass elevator rocketing towards space in an earthquake. <laughs> I'm a disembodied head with tiny T-Rex arms. So it's got to come out like the side oh of my, my face, gosh. right? You're, you're on a pogo a stick. In a Dang, dude. Raid, riding a horse. Yeah, but I'm a, wow. I'm just a head. Like, I'm just going to chomp on to your horse. Dude, I got tiny T-Rex arms coming out my face. Like, normally tiny oh, T-Rex arms is no big dude. deal, right? But if they're right here, right? Dude, a horse can kick a bear in the face and kill it. Yeah, I'm not going to be behind the horse. Dude, you have tiny T-Rex arms. You're not going to be moving quickly. Uh, You don't know. I'm on a pogo stick, dude. <laughs> I'm going to I'm gonna pogo all up on you and dude, bite you. The, ow, you have the ow, ow, to ow. On a pogo stick? Yeah. I'm I'm a big disembodied head. Okay. 
<laughs> With maybe. Anyways, Girl Scout is a young child, already just crazy as can be, and then in a berserker rage, riding a horse. Disembody head don't care. Disembody head don't care because he smashed the bits. Disembody head's gonna be like, ow, 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 all up on that Girl Scout. And normal yeah, people would say that's a bad thing, but it's just dis it's a disembodied head. Style. Even with the pogo stick. Dude, going for the jugular. Now, ow! Pogo stick up to your throat. You're berserking, yeah. you but it doesn't matter. There's just going to be boxes of Girl Scout cookies everywhere right into your mouth. And you're not going to be able to get it out because you got to use your T-Rex arms See what to I'm hold doing? to the pogo stick. This is your blood from the jugular uh, that's your of, the, of, of the Girl Scout. I see you'd have no blood. Yeah, you're right. I wouldn't. That's why I wouldn't die. I would just be Girl Scout. I, I'd just be chomping on Girl Scout. So, to give you a visual. I don't think it's still Girl Scout and a berserker riding a horse, and we're in a glass elevator rocking towards space. Yeah, I'm in a pogo stick with tiny T-Rex arms, man. Be pogoing all over. Like in the little room, it's like pogo, 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 pogo. It'd be like it'd be like the system of a down song. Jump, pogo, 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 oh, bounce. Oh. Sorry, man. I really, I was gonna vote for disembodied head because of the, the spaces, but you can't really go for the scout because of the rage. You're gonna go straight for the jugular. Yeah, all right, all right. But it was good to visualize, though, right? Was that right? <laughs> yeah, see. I feel that made me a winner all on all on its own. <laughs> I am sure, yeah. <laughs> Make me feel good. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> well, this is per perfect. This is gonna be I don't good. think my Twitch chat's hey, working. Oh, wow. Newcomer versus Word Whacker. LA traffic, molasses flood. Three, oh boy. A molasses two, flood. One, super <laughs> oh, jeez. All right. Wow, this is. Ooh. So, cowboy swinging a shark on a chain. Swinging a chain. This. What? This is so dumb. Is your chain the sauces last, though, though? Like, <laughs> I've got is that a the chain? I've got a shark on a chain and a infinite sausage lasso. I think it's both hands. So it's yep. like I'm using both here. Lasso the zombie down. The zombie's gonna go after the sausage because he thinks it's human flesh. No, the sausage isn't human flesh though. <laughs> it could be. What if it's what if it's what if it's, what if it's human sausage? Yeah, if it's like ground human. Yeah, it could be human <laughs> sausage. Logistic then. <laughs> Dude, he's got a swinging shark. Hero over here. Okay, one, I'm wearing a suit of armor, and I'm a super genius zombie. So we're if we're in traffic, I thought I'm just going to dodge your shark chain. Or don't have brain function. Hopefully it lands in the molasses flood. It's going to get stuck for a little bit, because we know molasses. Well, zombies are slow anyways. Then they're going to get stuck. Like, <laughs> swing a He's shark a chain, genius. boom. He's a super genius. He's just going to, like, get up onto the cars. Now, he has okay. to get rid of his booties. Zombies don't have brain function, though. How can you be a super genius? That's just how it works. That's how the cards play, bro. <laughs> <laughs> and then, if we're in LA traffic, we have to this fled. Like, the zombie has no chance. I've got a swinging shark on a chain. People are going to move. I'm going to be part in that traffic like Moses. Uh, I have you been to LA? Because they don't move for shiz. <laughs> for a swinging shark chain. <laughs> they no, do. Not even that. They won't even move for the cops most of the time. Jeez. I feel like swinging shark on a chain beats yeah, cops, though. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, but there's all those uh, cars in the way. So if he misses and it gets stuck. Shark on a chain. That's my case. Yeah. Super genius. Is that... With no brain function. What? He's a super genius. If a super genius is still a zombie, he's still a zombie. It doesn't matter. He... Oh, man. Oh, Ooh, yeah. The, the whole zombie thing. like. Yeah. Wearing a suit of armor just also helps you 
doesn't help you get out of said molasses. I said you can take out your it's booties. Take off your booties. <laughs> <they're> fine. <laughs> like, have you ever got awesome. stuck in the mud? You just take your boots off and you go. You leave it. All right, how, how, all right, how, friends. How, next. Oh. I... Ooh, cards. All right, do it. Oh, Bailey's not. Gates. Oh, looks like that's it. All right, friends. It was fun. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you later.